Hi, my name's Catherine Dew, and this is from the mothers. My grandmother is eight years old when she sees her birth mother bleed into a wooden bucket. She hears moaning, melting, something godless as the blood pours like congealed tea from a flask. Forty hours later, the light unfastens tenderly from her birth mother's eyes. Months after her birth, my grandmother is sold to a family with food and a stillborn daughter. They live on the other side of the mountains, away from Chongqing, away from the war. They will love a ghost, clothe her, feed her. She will swipe scraps in the dark, find a way to send them back to her five blood siblings. The family with food belongs to a textile tycoon. It yawns, rich from the blood of others. Before her eyes know to lower, her voice to cool, my grandmother asks where the swollen lilies are born. Her milk mother holds her like a glass doll. Cotton is a dream, my angel. Never question the mother of dreams. It is December 13, 1937, a day as time-worn as bloodless winter light. My grandmother is beginning to forget the shape of her birth mother's voice when they descend. The Japanese, their gun-licked fingers, their salt-smoked lips. 300,000 Chinese will sprinkle these streets. Unborn children glued to the tips of bayonets, bodies in the dust. Most are women with bellies sliced open like flayed salmon, purple bruised legs, splayed out in invitation. <laughs>